Hello. We heard you have a question from your recruiters or hiring managers. Why can't I see the organization I need when creating a requisition? Stay tuned for some great solutions to this issue. In this scenario, a hiring manager is creating a job requisition. In the requisition structure section, the manager tries to complete the required organization field, but either no organization is listed or the desired organization is not on the list. Therefore, when the continue button is clicked, an error occurs. Okay, now let's take a look at four quick solutions to solve this issue. Solution 1. Verify the organization tree code doesn't contain any spaces. For this solution, start in Setup and Maintenance and search for a task, Manage Organization Trees. Click the task. From the list of organization trees, locate the recruiting organization tree and expand it. Notice the active organization tree. You will highlight the tree code name to make sure it doesn't have any trailing or leading spaces. If it does, you'll need to go back to the recruiting tree and duplicate that whole tree. Use the Actions Duplicate menu. Put in a tree code name and a new name, as well as duplicate the active version. Once the process runs, you will have a new recruiting tree on your list. This needs to be active as well. From the Actions menu, go to Set Status and Active. You will need to run an audit to make sure that this tree can be active in the system. Click Online Audit and the process will run. You'll get a verification and click Done. Remember, go back to your original active recruiting tree and set it to inactive or delete it. In Setup and Maintenance for Recruiting, select the new correct organization tree. We'll cover this in Solution 4. Solution 2. Ensure that the organization tree code is flattened. To start, again, access the Manage Organization Tree task. Highlight the active recruiting tree. Go to Actions, Flatten, and Row Flattening. Then click Online Flattening. The process will run, then click Done. Solution 3. Confirm that the correct data role was assigned to the user and that the data role includes the appropriate organization security profile. In order to verify that the user has access to the correct organization, start with My Client Groups and Workforce Structures. Locate or search for the task entitled Preview HCM Data Security. Access the task. Enter the name of the user who needs to be verified. Once the currently assigned roles appear, view the Organization Security Profile column. If the organization needed is not represented in the group or not specifically listed, then a new data role will need to be assigned to that user. Solution 4. Verify that the correct organization tree used for recruiting is active and selected in Setup and Maintenance. In Recruiting Setup and Maintenance, click Recruiting and Candidate Experience Management and the Enterprise Recruiting and Candidate Information task. Locate the Recruiting Organization Tree Name field and view the list of values. Verify the field contains the desired Recruiting Organization Tree Name, noting any changes from Solution 1. These solutions help answer the question, why can't I see the organization I need when creating a requisition? For more information, please reference these documents.